2023 is already shaping up to be a killer year for movies. As the last few days of the year tick down, we've been treated to several trailer drops and sneak peeks of upcoming movies. We're getting animated projects that have been several years in the making. Marvel is entering phase five, and we're gonna have a summer full of plastic and explosives. Mmm, that's good, plastic explosive. And that's just the first half of the year. So without further ado, here are my most anticipated movies of 2023. First off, we have the Super Mario Bros. movie. This animated feature brought to us by Illumination appears to be the most accurate translation of a video game to film. Illumination is putting everything they have into making the Mushroom Kingdom look stunningly vibrant. The casting feels spot on, despite known Italian actor Chris Pratt as the titular Mario. We haven't heard much of his voice in the trailers, as it remains to be seen if he can pull it off. I'm just ready for a whole movie of Keegan-Michael Key's Toad. Do not touch that mushroom, you'll die! Oh, I'm sorry, <laughs> that one's perfectly fine. This year is looking like a big year for animation. On June 2nd, we'll be getting the much-anticipated Spider-Man sequel, Across the Spider-Verse. There's not much that I can say about this one, as the plot isn't really known. What we do know is there's going to be a lot of spider people, such as Issa Rae's Jessica Drew and Oscar Isaac's Miguel O'Hara. It'll be interesting to see them interacting with Shamik Moore and Haley Steinfeld's characters from the first film. When I first heard James Mangold was directing the next Indiana Jones movie, my instant response was, yes, of course, get the guy who made Logan to tell the next story about an aging Indiana Jones. That's perfect. Mangold's directing portfolio is stacked full of action and character-driven narratives, which sounds like the perfect send-off for Harrison Ford's iconic character. I'm pairing these up because they both release on July 21st. Greta Gerwig's Barbie and Christopher Nolan's Oppenheimer are going to make for an interesting summer. That's it. That's all that needs to be said. Two interesting films from two incredibly talented directors. It's going to be a summer to remember. So that's it for now. We know we're getting several other exciting films that will hopefully not get booted into 2024, but only time will tell. Until next time, Happy New Year, and I'll see you in 2023.